Hi everybody. It's my queen's eye. Um, thank you for stopping past my YouTube channel. Um, if you like the content, subscribe. Make sure you hit like on the video. Um, I just wanted to come on here because I thought about doing a, a video, a reading, a general reading. I figured since I had the quiet time to do it, I will do it now. And I pulled, um, I already pulled three cards from my own deck, my queen's eye, made by me. And the cards that popped out was the skeletons are coming out the closet. Then we have think for yourself. And then sometimes it's too late. See, it's fading away. Sometimes it's too late. And at the bottom of that deck is eye open. So with that off the bat, I'm getting that um, anybody that's been trying to hide anything from you, um, any secrets, any, any, anything, any, anything that will try to cause an ending um, to you or anything that you have worked hard for. Um, and these people, their skeletons are coming out of the closet they're being exposed and look if you look at the skeletons they they trying to come out because they can't hide no more they can't hide it no more that door going to pop off <laughs> literally <laughs> they can't hide it no more and these skeletons coming out because they like to follow the crowd. They don't like to think for themselves. Everybody has their own mind. Why are you following shit that, that you know is going to get exposed? But if you didn't know, now you know. It's not going to work. It's over. And these people could have done things that, uh, you know, that was that was really like horrendous. The things done to you, the things said about you, like, you know, it's really some sometimes like it's really no coming back from shit. Sometimes it's too late. I said earlier, it's fading away. Time is fading away. Them skeletons is coming out. They're coming out. Y'all have to think for yourself. You can't, you can't be <laughs> following a crowd, especially if you're following a crowd that that's up to no good. And you know they up to no good. So I'm getting ready to pull some tarot. Um, this deck is called uh, Tattoo Art, Ink, and Intuition. I really like this deck. Um, so we're going, we going to see. <laughs> I cracked open the deck. It's the Ten of Swords with the Three of Coins. The Ten of Swords with the Three of Coins. These is people that worked against you to end you. They skeletons is coming out the closet. And like I said, sometimes it's too late. Sometimes it's too late to come back from certain shit. Four coins. Cause they holding they holding shit back from you, right? This could even be theft, right? Cause these people done done tried so hard and so long <laughs> to keep these skeletons in the closet and the door about to come off. It's about to come off the hinges. It's about to come to an end. 
and or this could be something that's going to be be known worldwide people working against you to cause to cause your downfall like these people don't even have that kind of authority nobody does page of wands though good news is coming saw the page of wands with the death card and the eight of wands the eight of wands fell out but the page of wands and the death card it might be some news coming of somebody's death because these people have uh, done so many things and tried to hide so many things and because they don't want people to actually see the real them, right? They 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 gotta try to get rid of the 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 problem to them. Something that's not a problem, they created a problem. What's this eight of wands? Or this could be with the eight of wands under the skeletons are coming out the closet this could be one of these people right maybe a few because this is a few heads i see in that card so it could be a few people uh try to reach out to you are going to reach out to you but it's because they skeletons is coming out they they want to know what you know because they know you think for yourself And then they also know sometimes it's too late. We can't come back from this shit. Can't come back from it. Let's just think for yourself. What's this? The eight of coins. <laughs> the eight of coins with the nine of swords. So for some of you, this could be... Um, regarding work people that you work with could be uh talking hella shit like nine of swords nine of swords is like vicious gossip putting people names and scandals and shit and it's because you you know how to be you you know how to to think for yourself it's because you recognize people that who act one way and are truly another. Or you could be getting getting some getting a message. It could be phone call, text, email, a letter, however, right? You could be getting some some communication about your name being in a scandal or somebody saying some hella shit about you that's not true and this could also be uh whether it's family friends co-workers right whomever they could even be feeling like being in this nine of swords energy because you think for yourself. You don't need to to be in a crowd. You're you're good on your own. What's this sometimes it's too late? The page of coins, page of pentacles, right? So that's page of pentacles, that's news, right? It could be these people having to start over and be a beginner and learning something. Learning how to, to, to... <laughs> money business with the ace of wands right here because you 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 are 
You are your own person. You are not afraid to, to be a, a student. Everybody who's a teacher had to be a student at one point. So, so you went from, you went from learning something new, right? This could even be learning how to, to uh, bring more finances around, learning a skill. And you won't take action all by yourself, all by yourself. And these people is really going to realize that, damn, sometimes it's too late. <laughs> With the nine of cups at the bottom of the deck. You're going to get your wish fulfillment. Why they got to sit back and realize how selfish they've been. And they gonna realize how how it feel for that shit to be done to them, but it's actually the truth this time. The truth. Wait, let me get the let me get a different deck. Where is? Get my Kipper deck out. Yeah, these these people like they they done, they messed up, <laughs> and they could probably really still think like right as as I'm speaking that they still gonna get away with this shit. This is the third time I done shuffled the deck. And this is the third time that poverty in courthouse has shown itself. So, I'm, we gonna leave them out. Somebody might be getting some communication from a courthouse or having to go to court because some shit has come out. Some shit has come out that people have left somebody out in the cold maybe regarding a court situation somebody didn't get a letter or somebody didn't get a message what's this what's this courthouse what's this courthouse please main female in reverse So maybe, so main female in reverse. So maybe this was somebody at one point who thought they, they was it, right? They just knew that they was going to get away with some shit. This main female could also be a karmic low vibrational energy somebody who think they it and they not they do extra shit and and it came out reverse so this is somebody who who is not it <laughs> this is somebody who doesn't want people to see their skeletons coming out of the closet they don't want that so they got a, a nine of swords somebody else because of their own shit don't work like that you really got people out here that think for they self they really don't need a crowd not even really they don't need a crowd
eight of coins is the eight of pentacles like eight of eight of eight of pentacles is also like copycat energy because in the original tarot it's a it shows an individual um sitting right working on themselves, working on a skill right but then it shows like in in all of the seven coins all of the stars are 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 uh marked right like nothing is missing nothing is thrown off but on that last pinnacle they fucked up they curved the line they didn't make that line straight that's the part that they missed that's the part that got them caught up that's the part that got these skeletons coming out of the closet these people be simple so they got to talk shit about you because they trying to be you acting like they think for they self and everything like that and, and no that ain't what it is <laughs> that ain't what it is Think for yourself. Stop trying to be a copycat. You'll be surprised what what will come out of you putting their own time and effort in 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 doing better. You have a lack mentality. Think for yourself. Learn something that you're good at. If you don't know what you're good at, look shit up on, on YouTube. <laughs> shit, that's what I do. See, I'm giving you pointers. <laughs> Think for yourself, though. This is... <laughs> was calling out for the nine of swords and the eight of coins and judication popped out. They under judgment for that. They under judgment for 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 making people look at you in a different light. They they under judgment for uh putting your name in some shit that ain't probably had nothing to do with you. But again, they can't they can't show their own face. So they gotta make it look like somebody else. Thinking that, yeah, all I gotta do is <laughs> is is say this and they gonna believe me. It ain't never gonna get back to her or him. What's this adjudication? And the judge the judge is even looking like because we already got courthouse out here and the judge is even looking like come on yo do that even make sense to you why do you feel like that's okay for you to say or for you to do now they gonna be in a state of worry and a state of anxiety can't sleep at night probably having nightmares because they put something out into the universe on you that is not you that's not how you operate if the shoe don't fit don't try to wear that motherfucker <laughs> like what's this adjudication toy on labor yeah toy on labor They work real hard. They probably they this this shit probably these people these people kind of like remind me of. I always feel like this card is like a generational card. It could be magic too, depending on the spread. But it's three people in this card. I don't know if y'all can see, but it's three people in this card, right? This one has light over her. The other two are in the background. 
Somebody tried to put the spotlight on somebody and it didn't work. They tried to make somebody look like make somebody look like they was in poverty. And that's not how that go. And somebody probably about to be in poverty too. Just because they don't know how to think for themselves. This could be over uh, a relationship too. This could be a main female <laughs> false person and concern. Like, come on. Like, come on. This could be a main female, right? Who was probably dealing with somebody, right? Because they had money and shit like that, right? Or they just, they could get something, something from them. It didn't matter what it was. Attention, money, drugs, sex, whatever, a ride, whatever, you know. And they, that person might have, might have met somebody, right? No. You know, they might have been chilling. Maybe wasn't a whole lot of conversation all the time but they ain't never had no problems with one another and then you got this main female right who probably noticed who probably picked up on some shit or probably heard some shit from other people and now she got a problem now she got a problem so she gonna try to make something hard for somebody Try and put the spotlight on somebody and that shit ain't gonna work. <laughs> they a thief. Just saw that. Like people people be doing the most. People be doing the most and then really not doing nothing at all. Like think for yourself. You gonna put yourself through all this turmoil. You gonna put yourself through all this turmoil just to be like somebody else. Like, come on. All that hard work you doing, you doing for that. You could be putting putting it into your own self, into your self love, to your self care. <laughs> like. What you learning new? What you researching today? Google everybody friend. What's adjudication with Chloe on labor? Yeah. Because she want that gift. She want a gift that don't even belong to her. Look at that big ass gift. How you want all of that? And you, 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 you doing too much. <laughs> Or you working too hard and not getting nothing on your return because you ain't getting that because it don't belong to you. Do the main female in reverse. Like, yeah, mature man popped out. What's the page of coins with the ace of wands? Sudden wealth, right? That's clarifying the page of the page of pentacles and the ace of wands. And with sometimes it's too late. When somebody is learning something, right? Or this could even let, let me say this. When somebody learning something new, right, and they take action on it, it's 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 going to it's it could bring sudden wealth, right? But it could also make somebody feel like sudden wealth. They love it. They passionate about it. This could also be like, you know, for people in a relationship. When somebody is, when somebody has to start over, right? It, it could be, it could be overwhelming. It could be overwhelming. But taking that action it's going to make you feel like sudden wealth. And if you feel like sudden wealth, you're going to manifest sudden wealth. And 
then somebody going to realize again that it's too late. It's no coming back. This could even be in that relationship. Them, them talking about their spouse. They putting their spouse in a scandal or vicious gossip or making them have sleepless nights. Dark night of the soul. Maybe they learning how to think for themselves. And not and not worry about how other people feel about what they should be doing for them. The fuck? How, right? What's this sudden love? How? Is <laughs> yes, the message came out in reverse. Somebody missed that memo. <laughs> And somebody is not getting a message that's going to make them feel like sudden wealth. They're going to feel like a page of coins. They're going to feel that small, that childish. Because they did too much with the toil and labor here. They did too much. And the nine of swords. Like, you did too much. You did too much. You're not, you not, you not getting that sudden wealth. That don't belong to you. That's that gift. That shit don't belong to you. And or somebody didn't get a message about their money. That somebody might have stole from them. I did see the thief card. Sudden wealth. Message in the room. But it's still coming. It's still coming. And that's what I mean. Like nobody. And people in their head about it. They fucking ran and go to jail with them skeletons coming out the closet. They fucking ran and 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 get a fucking somebody might get a settlement because somebody put their name in a in a scandal and it wasn't true. And people going to jail. Y'all see that imprisonment. People going to jail. People is crazy. Yeah, they going to jail with the they imprisonment and family room. Secrets, skeletons coming out. Well, these people might be having a discussion about about what they need to try to do. But it's not gonna work. Somebody is really trying to hide money from somebody they trying to end somebody yeah false person damn but somebody it could be somebody child the child could know uh, a family secret or be sitting around discussing how how they gonna set something up Watch your motherfucking kids. Because I am. <laughs> Privileged lady at the bottom of the deck. Somebody. Somebody. Somebody about to be good. Or. This could this is what this main female thought she was, a privileged lady. But her ass here ain't go to jail. Her and her whole crew. Her and her own crew. I'm gonna use the moonology deck, and I'm gonna end this reading. Yeah. If you gotta, if you gotta do a whole bunch of stuff to hurt people and everything like that, like you should really reconsider like your life, reevaluate your life, like really sit back and and evaluate what you invested your time, your energy, your money, like all of that. Sit back and reflect on what you really put out there. And then you might come to terms with 
how shit is playing out in your life. I ain't perfect, but I always try to stay on a high vibration. One, because that shit is not appealing. It's really not. But I will get in somebody's ass if I need to. I don't just do it just because. Each of these cards got a three in it. <laughs> what messages do you have? Oh, okay. You are very close to achieving your goal. <laughs> oh, damn, this was a lot. <laughs> I'm going to read them all, too. You have, you're very close to achieving your goal. A new start is coming. <laughs> wow. Prosperity lies ahead. Balance, spirituality, and practicality. Don't let your past hold you back. <laughs> Adjustments are required. You are good enough. A win-win outcome is forecast. Work through your fears. And luck is on your side. So with that, whoever is, is always in a low vibration or, you know, trying to make people or others look at somebody in a different kind of light, you know, they don't, they have to work on fears. They have to work on their insecurities. They have to look at themselves first. Because when, when you were on that side, right, when you had to have your sleepless nights because you was confused about a lot of shit you was learning, right, it could even be through tarot, even through tarot readings, right? And you had to you had to go through moments, a lot of moments where you crying. You don't know if you good enough. <laughs> you don't know why certain things is happening to you or why they happen to you. And with you going through that that work that inner work, that inner healing, you was able to heal a lot of stuff. It's not to say everything is healed because n nobody is 100%, right? But for the most part, you put the work in every day to give yourself love because you can't give people love if you don't have it yourself first. can and for those that put the work in their luck is on their side prosperity lies ahead for them the will is is turning now everybody that was up is getting ready to be down and everybody that was down is getting ready to be up but they say that the the law of attraction i just want to get a few of uh, some messages that i made up myself See what come out here. Just take a few of them. <laughs> Truth hurts. Fake love. Protect yourself. Say get down or lay down. Cause this this mean this ain't even on no uh you know what they say trying to unalive somebody. This not even what that mean. This mean you either gonna get down on your own. You gonna you gonna put the work in to do this shit the right way for yourself first, or you gonna be forced to do it by the Most High. Because he's going to put you in a situation where you ain't going to have a choice but to get down. Tch. 
mask had fallen off. That's 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 good for me. That's good for me. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the reading. Um, I will be back. I try to come back later. I'm gonna get another message out. All right, guys. Thank you. Bye.